And several historic buildings in downtown Alexandria are all but destroyed tonight. This after a fire began early this morning. Our Rob Olson is live for us tonight. So, Rob, this is a really big loss for that community. Yeah, but no lives were lost here, and that's the important thing. Uh, that's the good news uh, in a bad day in uh, Alexandria. The 20 people or so displaced that lived upstairs here now being helped by the Red Cross. Some have actually found apartments already, which is uh, part of the outpouring from this community here. But as you can see, this looks like a war zone. There's a big hole here in this historic downtown. It's really heartbreaking because to see the scar on Broadway, the destruction of a historic corner of Alexandria's Main Street is truly emotional for so many in this town. And those were their livelihoods, and it just makes me really sad. Tony Walker lived most of her life in one of the apartments, now destroyed. I was actually born in one of those apartments. The call came at 4.34 a.m. and firefighters arrived to find heavy flames and very thick smoke. 20 residents of 13 apartments on the upper floor of these four connected buildings, all out safely, but their homes and the businesses below lost. My heart goes out to them. I've spoken with a few of them, and uh, they're taking the same approach for the most part. It's buildings and uh, no lives. Five departments and 110 firefighters worked for hours. The Douglas County Sheriff's Department using a drone with an infrared image to finally put out what still smoldered. It showed us exactly where the hot spots were. We were able to direct the streams uh, from the aerials to those hot spots. Pieces knocked down to get at those hot spots added to the emotional punch for those watching. It's just kind of bites, you know, after all these years I've lived here all my life. And watch all that history and stuff go up. A tattoo shop, a children's boutique, a home decor store, and the popular rapper's grill and bar gone in buildings that date back to the late 1800s. Historic, but now history. I always thought that I'd go back to that apartment when I grew up and see how much it changed, but I don't think I'll ever get that chance now. Yeah, that's uh, sad. What's lost here? No cause determined as of yet. The state fire marshal was in today to investigate this. The fire chief says, based on what they saw when they first got here, it looked like it had originated down here, not upstairs. But again, that's uh, unofficial at this point. That's just his observation. They'll wait for the fire marshal to make an official determination. Live in Alexandria, Robelson, Fox 9.